Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Andrew, and if you're here to learn more about cryptocurrencies. So I wanted to issue a warning to any Dogecoin holder. Um, you may know this stuff, you may not. I just know that today and tonight is a big night because Elon Musk is on Saturday Night Live and has tweeted about doing a number of Doge skits. And anytime Elon tweets or talks about Doge, it goes way up in value, but I have a feeling after tonight, it's gonna go way back down. Um, that's just speculation. I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. I just wanna give you my take on this because this channel is about, you know, just learning more together about cryptocurrency. So here's a couple facts that I just want you to be aware of that by today, by tonight, um, you could either take advantage of this or, you know, hopefully, you know, uh, everything works out after that as well. So keep this in mind. So first of all, Dogecoin, uh, I did a previous video on this, but just to wrap it up, it's essentially a meme coin that was kind of the start of meme coins. It was literally started as a joke. There is un an unlimited supply of Dogecoin. So the thing that makes Bitcoin so valuable is that there is a limited supply. There will only ever be 21 million Bitcoin. So as that scarcity is built into the system, it makes the coin much more. And there's an unlimited supply of Dogecoin out there. So Elon is a huge fan. And as he keeps tweeting about this, he's been on the record saying that, you know, how ironic would it be that these cryptocurrencies that are brand new, trying to become a global currency, that the one coin that was literally started as a joke actually becomes one of the top cryptocurrencies. And so far, he's been able to, you know, pump this up. So there's been a lot of good things going for it. If you've been a Dogecoin holder and you've made a lot of money off of it, congratulations to you. I'm happy for anyone who gets into cryptocurrency and makes money. So I'm not knocking anyone holding this. I personally do not hold any uh, for a couple of reasons why. Number one, kind of the success of Dogecoin has really been on the, the heels or on the back of Elon. He's really been the one tweeting it up. And if for any reason he starts talking negatively about it, it's basically riding on one person. So just keep that in mind as well. Also, what has me worried is that there's one whale. And if you don't know what a whale is, it's someone that holds, you know, it's a big uh, investor into any sort of cryptocurrency um, and holds a large position. There's one person that holds over 28% of all Dogecoin in circulation. And then also the top 11 wallets that uh, hold Dogecoin hold over 46% of all circulating Dogecoin. That's what's so neat about blockchain and cryptocurrency is that it's completely private. We don't know who these people are, but on the Dogecoin blockchain, we're able to see you know, the distribution of Dogecoin. And we're, we know for a fact that these top 11 wallets hold over 46%. And just to put that into perspective, just this one, the one that holds 28%, that's valued at about $25 billion. So we're talking about a huge chunk of change here. Now for you, you maybe have a couple thousand dollars in, maybe a couple hundred, you know, maybe tens of thousands of dollars, who knows? But all it takes is one of these people to cash out and especially on a night like this where there's so much hype around it you know people who are very new to cryptocurrency they hear about dogecoin this is the very first thing that they buy you know buy it on the way up and close to the top and then after tonight one of these guys decide to to sell it off and everyone loses their shirt so be very careful it's uh like i said it was started as a joke so that's widely out there and we know that. Um, but once again, if you're a holder of this, congratulations to you, you've probably made some money, but just be very careful because it's basically riding on one person's word. And you know, if any of this changes uh, towards Dogecoin, then we could end up losing a lot of money. So uh, once again, not financial advice, just wanna give you my perspective on this. Um, Maybe one day I'll be a Dogecoin holder because it may become, you know, like uh, Elon said, it may become an actual currency. So uh, I'm putting my money elsewhere on projects that have real utility, 
you know, real company behind it where it's actually, you know, I see it doing some things in the long run. But um, hopefully, uh, once again, don't listen to me. Don't listen to anyone else. Do your own research, make up your own mind, and do the investment that's best for you. So thanks a lot. Leave any questions or comments in the comments below. And if you want to get these videos when I upload them weekly, then like and subscribe. Thanks a lot. See you guys.